And then it shut down. It slowed down, allowing that gigantic system to grow and stay as big as it is. Scientists suspect that the size of the planets may be key in determining the different fates of Earth and Mars. The Earth is so big, more than double the size of Mars in volume. It has retained so much internal energy. It's really hot down inside the Earth. And that helps to rip apart the crust of the Earth and make the plates like those we see here in Iceland. On Mars, it's a smaller planet. It has less internal energy. And that explains the giant, more stagnant types of tectonics we see in the Valles Marineris. And because Mars is so much smaller than Earth, no volcanic greenhouse gases or moisture can stabilize the thin and unpredictable atmosphere. In fact, where the weather of Earth is controlled by the action of water, on Mars, a different sort of compound commands the climate of the planet, dust. In a warmer, wetter time, this may be what Mars looked like. Lakes, rivers, and oceans may have once covered a good deal of the red planet. Where did all that liquid water go? And what tools can we use here on Earth to answer this question? Next, how this 1962 nuclear test in Nevada may help us understand what the rovers find on Mars. We'll return to our Science Channel special presentation on the Discovery Channel. I like picking the goal that's just beyond what I think we can finish. Jesse James is the monster inside Monster Garage. He can build anything, he can do anything. On top of that, he knows what's cool. Meet the mastermind behind Discovery Channel's breakout hit. I'm just, you know, a glorified welder. And see why America has a new favorite outlaw. Discovery Channel goes inside the garage every Monday at 9. Brought to you by the new Chevrolets. 10 new cars and trucks in 20 months. An American Revolution. Chevy Colorado Crew Cab has the biggest interior in its class. So if you're ever uncomfortable, it won't be because of lack of space. Man, I feel like a woman. Everything's bigger in Colorado. An American Revolution. Quicker refund and receipt confirmation. Log on or tell your tax preparer to e file for you and join the 53 million e filers who consider it done. Tomorrow, the intensely competitive world of go kart racing is exposed on the premiere of Gold Star Racing 3, only on the Discovery Channel. There she goes. There she Be goes. true to yourself with a birth control pill that gives you a high level of effectiveness and a low level of hormones, like ortho tricyclin low. You get clinically proven effectiveness, cycles that are more predictable, and it's nice to know that ortho tricyclin low is from the maker of the number one prescribed birth control pill. It's a byproduct of volcanic activity. Even more impressive are the startling images that have already emerged from Opportunity. They reveal thin layers in an outcropping of rocks just a stone's throw from the lander platform. This indicates the rocks may have formed from sediments carried by water or wind or from falling volcanic ash. If the outcropping turns out to be sedimentary, liquid water is likely to blame. A massive discovery that could lead to proof life once existed on Mars. It's going to be fascinating beyond words to, uh, to, to get up close and personal with this thing. These aren't lava flows. These are something that we've never seen on Mars before. 
So we are about to embark on what is arguably going to be the coolest geologic field trip in human history. The rover missions are planned for 90 Martian days, but it is likely to take the science community years to analyze all the data the robotic geologists transmit back to Earth, a step in a process that may eventually lead to humans on Mars. Spirit and opportunity do more than search for water. They are pioneers. It's very exciting working on this project. This is, it's what I've always wanted to do. To see it all come together and unfold and drive off this platform and now start to touch the soil. And bring back this data that everybody has been waiting so anxiously for. good to be a part of history and to, to put a great engineering marvel together. Today, we search for the answer to the question of what happened to liquid water on Mars. Did the loss of tectonic activity, the cooling of the Martian dynamism, so change the atmosphere that it could no longer hold water? Is the absence of magnetism on Mars responsible for the planet's desiccated state? What lessons about Mars's fate apply to our own planet? The answers lie in the rocks of two sister planets spinning in the heavens. And the science that two amazing rovers can bring back to a curious world. Go to discovery.com and click on the Science Channel for continuous coverage of NASA's mission to Mars, 24 hours a day. The Science Channel, finding science everywhere. Coming up, meet the freezing Dutchman, a man who is trying to break a world record for icing.